All right, now to our continuing coverage, the FDA greenlighting the, import, the importing of 1.3 million cans of Gerber baby formula from Mexico amid the national formula shortage. The Good Start Gentle Formula cans will be imported from July through October. It's enough to make 33 million 8-ounce infant bottles. The supply expected to be sold on Gerber's website and through other key retailers. Well, the White House is concerned the parents, you may, not be, you may be making some dangerous decisions because of this ongoing baby formula shortage. One of the president's assistants spoke with our Andy Cohen about the steps the Biden administration is taking to get through this crisis. Andy joins us now in our studio with more. Andy. Robin Diane, the White House really wants parents to know that it's dangerous to water down infant formula or to try to make it at home from scratch. The military flew in another shipment of formula from Europe earlier this week. And so those labels, they may look a little unfamiliar to you when you see them in the store. The White House really wants parents to have confidence that the formula that you see on store shelves is safe for use. Now, Kristen Link Young, the deputy assistant to the President for Health and Veterans Affairs, told me over Zoom that some babies may have specific health care needs that require a special type of formula. So you should talk with your doctor about which brands are arriving from Europe that you can use to keep your baby fed and healthy. We at the White House recognize how challenging this time period is for American families, and we are working around the clock to do everything in our power to boost domestic production of infant formula and bring additional infant formula into the country from abroad. He adds that the FDA has been working with other domestic manufacturers to increase production as well. Those efforts started in February, shortly after that Similac recall. Now, the Abbott plant, which makes Similac, it is expected to reopen soon. However, the company said last month that it could take an additional six to eight weeks from the start of production before that formula starts to arrive on store shelves. Andy Cohen, News 5.